Audrey and today I'm going to be spending 24 hours in a hotel room. So if you guys didn't know, we have been traveling a bunch this summer. Currently, we are in New York. So this is our New York hotel room. I'll give you a little tour or if you like to say tour, <laughs> I don't know. I think a lot of people say tour, but I say tour. So here we have the closet, really interesting. Okay, first off, bathroom, because bathrooms are always fun. All right, so this bathroom is not too giant. Whoa, I love the lighting, but it is pretty nice. We have our nice mirror, nice sink, nice toilet, nice shower tub. And that is the bathroom. Dance party in the bathroom. <laughs> and then out here is everything else. So, nice mirror shot. Oh, OOTD! <laughs> All the beauty girls be like. So I have my A shirt, which is really for Abercrombie and Fitch, but we'll just pretend it's for Audrey. And then I have my jeans and my strappy sandals that are my favorite. All right, moving on. So here are the beds. This is where I'm sleeping tonight. Mom's gonna be sleeping there. Jordan was sleeping there, but Jordan left us for a church camp. So now I get to sleep all by myself in a room with my mama. And I'm choosing in here because it's warmer than the other one. The reason why it is warmer in here is because Jordan and I are smart and we turned off the air conditioning while the rest of our family doesn't know how to turn off the air conditioning. Well, they apparently. Do, but they like it really cold. Well, we don't like it cold. So over here we have our coffee machine, which we never use, but we have the sweet mini fridge <laughs> with nothing inside. <laughs> Everyone loves a good mini fridge. No, no water. And we have the TV. Fun fact, did you know the TV remote is the grossest part of a hotel room because the people never clean it. Now you kids aren't ever gonna be touching the TV remotes. <laughs> You're welcome. Over here is the editing station where all the business happens. Currently, a YouTube video is being uploaded for my channel. It's approximately 39 seconds remaining, which is a lie because it's actually probably like another five minutes remaining. And then mom, what are you doing? I'm working on thumbnails and videos too. Good job, yes. such a hard working mom. I'll be here for the next 24 hours. <laughs> <laughs> she will be sitting at the desk because literally it does take a long time to get things ready. <laughs> and then over here we have our nice orange couch because you always need a pop of color in the room. But while I was sitting in this couch, I noticed something really disgusting that makes me not want to sit in the couch anymore. There's a good grease stain on the armrest. <laughs> so I'm not gonna be sitting there anymore. But anyways, here is our view from our window. We get a nice birch tree view. I think that's birch. Minecraft taught me well. All right, I guess the boys are gonna go in the hot tub, but since I'm spending 24 hours in the hotel room, I can't join them. <laughs> wow. Do you guys wanna see the boys' room? They're connecting. They're connected. Okay guys, I'm coming in. All right, this is the boys' room. So the boys are sharing a bed. There's dad's bed. Yeah. I guess they're watching TV right now. And yeah, it looks identical to the last one, except that their chair doesn't have a grease stain. <laughs> Our chair has a grease stain. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Okay, so right now is currently after lunch. We grabbed some McDonald's. Mom, do you want to be representing the McDonald's cup? Hey, proof, proof we had. I actually dogs. had breakfast for lunch. Yeah, because we, we've been waking up late. That's what I wanted. Because we are in New York and we live in Utah, and Utah is two hours behind. And so we're just off time. And we've been in Europe for like three weeks, and we're just really messed up right now. Because yeah. Europe is like seven hours ahead. Yeah, our travel schedule is crazy. This summer has been really crazy. If you want to check out those vlogs, go on Odd Vlogs to see those adventures. Okay, but now we have to figure out what to do after lunch because we just dropped Jordan off at church camp. So, any suggestions? <gasps> I know what I get to do that I never get to do. Dance party. No, I always have a Jump dance party. Bed. Yes! I'm jumping on my mom's bed. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Wait, there's cookies on there. <laughs> hey, you just flipped. <laughs> oh, I can touch the ceiling. Oh, it's poking. Yay! Audrey, don't jump 
on the bed. What if I break the bed? <laughs> what if so you break your chin? I got hurt jumping on the bed. Mom had to get stitches because she jumped on the bed and she cracked open her chin. That was fun. And my lips. My lips were 91. <laughs> no one wants to know that. <laughs> That's why I have stitches above my mouth is because I jumped on the bed as a kid. I also have stitches on my chin, but that was not from jumping on the bed. It was because when I was little, you might have heard this story already, I don't even remember. But I decided to go running to a playground because I was so excited to go running to a playground. <laughs> And my mom's like, don't run, there's a mat underneath you, you're gonna slip and fall. But who listens to their parents? Oh, so yeah. I ran, and I wasn't thinking, and I slipped on the mat, like they said, and I fell and cracked my chin open on the hard cement, and I had to go to the hospital and stuff, playing on the slide. Yep, so I always have stitches right here. You can't really see them, but you can feel them. If you touch it, you can feel it. <laughs> Anyways, now I'm out of breath. From jumping on the bed, I'm really out of shape. Let's go find the game and play it with the fam. Okay, so the game we're gonna be playing with my bros is called Conundrums. It's an app on the phone. So, first person to get to three wins. So you wanna pick the answer that you think most people would pick. All I'll right, go first. let's answer. Okay, Ty, would you rather be middle class and help others or be rich and selfish? Middle class and help others. You would rather, okay, let's see what people say. Most people agree, good job. So Ty, you got a point. <laughs> that was an easy answer. Okay, next one. Um, I'll do this one. Would you rather play an extremely small role as an extra in a very famous movie or star in an extremely terrible movie no one has ever heard of? Ooh, I'd say most people would pick a small role in a big movie, so that's what I'm gonna pick. Let's see. Yay! 90%! Okay, I got a point. Jake, it's your turn. Okay. Have your have your mom look at your search history or have all your last year's text sent to your GF slash BF? So would you rather have your mom look at your search history on your computer or your phone or have all of the texts that you send to your girlfriend or boyfriend? Well, I would do both because I don't have a girlfriend. Um, I guess this one then. Wrong! You don't get a point. Okay, Ty, your turn. Would you rather have eight kids or eight pets? Oh, that's easy. Hmm. Eight pets. You're right, Ty has two points. Oh my gosh, you're gonna win. I was going to do the kids. Okay, would you rather don't think and be happy 100% of the time, or think a lot and be happy 50% of the time? Pro uh, think I'm, a lot. That's what I'm gonna Think a lot. Think a lot. Happy. Think a lot happy. Yay, I got two points. Come on, Jake, you gotta get your point. Okay. What, would you rather watch Barney for the rest of your life? <laughs> Or watch Sesame Street. Sesame Street. Sesame Street. Yes. <laughs> yeah, you got a point. Okay, Ty, if you get this, you Would you win. rather have an ant problem you can't get rid of, or have a human-sized spider for a roommate? Oh. <laughs> I don't have that one. No problem. Mm -hmm. <gasps> Yay! Okay, Ty got to three points. Let's see if I can get to three points. Would you rather know why the bird is cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs or know why tricks aren't for kids? Probably tricks because I eat more tricks than Cocoa Puffs. Yeah! Okay, I got three points too. Would you rather be rich in medieval times or be poor in modern times? So you'd rather be poor in modern times? I got it! No, you didn't. It was at 22%. I guess so. So Jake got one point total. Me and Ty got three. High five, bro. Jake, you're just extraordinary. You you just don't match up with the you just get up. what everyone says. <laughs> that was so fun. Let's order some pizza for dinner. Yeah! Okay, you guys, so Jake and Ty and I played a few more rounds of that game, and also, heads up, now they're in the pool, 
And as soon as they get back, we're gonna order pizza for dinner because that's gonna take a while. But in the meantime, I'm being productive and getting some editing done. So I'm editing one of my vlogs right now. Check it out, all vlogs. Mom <laughs> is editing a video too. She's playing peekaboo with me, keeping me entertained. <laughs> and then we have a computer running over here that is uploading a video. So we're getting a lot of stuff done. It's it's pretty productive. And a creepy thing just happened to me. So I was sitting here editing like a normal person, and the phone rings twice. And at first, the first time I rang, I was like, "Ugh, do I have to really answer the phone?" And the second time it rang, I was like, "Final answer," because no one's gonna answer it. So I walk over here, pick up the phone. And this is what happens. There's no one on the other side. It was the creepiest thing ever and it just rang. Like I didn't let it sit for that long and I picked it up. No one was on the other side. I was like, hello, hello. And oh my gosh, it's so creepy. And this room keeps making noises. I'm pretty sure we're in a haunted room. Okay, you guys, update time. And you're gonna think I'm lying, but I am not lying. This is 100% real. <laughs> sitting here, and you know how I said earlier that we kept hearing noises? Well, I, I was just sitting here and I heard like a noise of keys dropping back by my bed. And I was like, mom, did you hear that? And she just stares at me like. <laughs> it was freaky. And then I look over and there's a hole in my wall that was not there before. Oh my gosh. Look, what happened? I don't want to touch it. <laughs> Why is the noise that's coming from my bed? What if it's a mouse? Oh no. I hope I can finish this vlog and be not possessed. <laughs> but I will keep you guys updated for any more creepy noises. I am not making this up. This is 100% real. This is not a skit. Update to the vlog once again. So we were just editing once more, continuing on. And we hear a loud noise, like our door open and closed because our rooms are connected. And we thought everyone returned from swimming. So mom's like, oh, go ask the boys to see if they're ordering pizza now. So I walk into the other room and no one is here. No one's in the bathroom. We checked all the rooms and my mom swears that someone walked in this room. No one's here. Okay guys, this is getting like serious. Now we're like really freaked out. What is going on? Oh my. Oh, I don't like this. Okay you guys, to prove that we don't think it's a different hotel room, cause I was like, well maybe it could be like the hotel room across from us. It's not. There's no hotel rooms across from There's our hotel room. Over here. We're Here's in the ours. Corner. We are in the corner the room. We have two rooms. There's no other rooms by us. And this is just an empty hallway, nothing there. Yeah. In there is just an elevator, but it came from that room, which is our room. The boys are sleeping there. It can't, there's nobody across. It can't be someone in that room hall. There's someone no one here. in that room and disappeared. There's no one here. Mom actually likes scary things. Like she wants me. our next hotel place to be haunted, but this is actually a little bit this is too creepy, much. Because this is like very real. The, oh, I don't like this. I seriously was a little nervous that there might be really a person hiding under the bed or in the drapes, so I started filling all the drapes <laughs> and looking under the beds because I heard the door open and close and nobody's there. And if you guys follow me on Twitter at All Around Audrey, you would have already heard this before this video was going up because I made a whole Twitter like thread on it. Oh my gosh, this is real. Oh, I don't know if I'm just on edge, but I'm hearing things a lot now like I heard a high pitch ringing over here and I heard like knocking and like walking on our ceiling but I think we're the only, I think we're the highest level I think there's only two levels but we're gonna go check it out we're going upstairs to it oh my gosh I have no shoes on me too great we're okay yeah. let's see if there's work. a level what this is the haunted enough. elevator it shows enough it shows enough but is there enough I don't know what is that there's people in there. <laughs> okay, you guys, so the people that came out of the elevator, they're the ones with the crying babies. 
Oh, the boys are back. They're the ones with the crying babies, and they're the ones that are closest. They're the ones that are closest to our hotel room, but it's still down the hallways. So it wasn't them because they were gone the whole time that all these things have happened. Dad, someone walked in your room and no one was there. I heard these doors closed. We gotta go the check door the elevator. Open it closed, and I said, and I am not. This is this not is, this is skit. And I said, Audrey, <laughs> go see. If the, I'm like, I'm getting hungry. Go tell the boys. That I'm, yeah. That's why we came up for hungry. And she's like, well, are they back? I'm like, yeah, didn't you just hear the door? They opened, they came in. We went and looked and nobody's there. I checked under the bed. I checked the and we're like, oh, maybe it's the neighbors. The neighbors are a while down and they're the ones with the crying babies, but they just they came just out of the elevator. Just watch them. They weren't there. All right, I'm getting the best of getting out of here. <laughs> so we gotta leave, but we gotta go. Above this. <gasps> the lights flickering. <laughs> <laughs> no, I didn't catch you on camera. No. I cut it in my eyes. <laughs> Something's happening with this. <laughs> Why are we haunted? Why would there be ghosts haunting us? We I don't understand. Downstairs. We were going to go upstairs and see. I know. This is for me. <laughs> I'm not saying this is for me. I've been trying to edit and I can't get anything done. Where's the. It said press the red button. I'm so freaked out. Okay, let's go check the elevator. <laughs> I'm in my gyms. <laughs> <laughs> Don't leave me out here alone. <laughs> you ditched me. <laughs> you little booger. <laughs> Mom got scared because the people came out of their hotel room and Mom was in her jammies. <laughs> this whole vlog is not 24 hours anymore. It's just my haunted vlog. Okay, let's go check the LV for real now. <laughs> okay, we're in the elevator. Oh, phew. There's four levels. We're good. We're good. Okay, exit the elevator. Okay, so, phew. There's four levels. That means that there are people above us. There's there four levels. There's We're good. Above? Yes. Okay, but the lights have been flickering. Great. Which is weird because they, we they haven't last night and they didn't flicker once. And uh. now today, just all of a sudden, while we were alone, things started happening. This is freaky. Why? Why? At least we're leaving here tomorrow. We could go to a really old house. Oh, that may also be haunted. Wait. <laughs> the light turned out by itself. <laughs> go turn it on. on. It's still on though. It is on. Look, where's the light switch? It says it's on. Here, I'll turn it off. Nothing changed. Okay. Um. Now I'm gonna flip it back on. <laughs> that was on a few seconds ago and then start flickering really fast oh. and now it's out. Yep, that's gone. This is 100% real. Some of you are gonna think this is fake. This is not fake. I am not kidding right now. I would not I would not joke around like this. Okay guys, like I was saying earlier, we stayed in this hotel room yesterday and nothing weird happened at all. But today we went like touring around New York and we went to this really super old grave site where everything was run down. Like there were like a lot of the gravestones you couldn't see because it's been like so they're so years. old, like since the 1800s. You can't even read the tombstones. That's like how worn out they are. And what I'm thinking is like, why is why would someone haunt us? And someone but married. It could have been because we accidentally stepped on someone's gravesite or disturbed them, and they don't like that. And that's why they followed us to this hotel room. Oh no. <laughs> Let's just hope that they stay here and they don't follow us like wherever we go because haven't you like seen all those TV shows where they like follow the people instead of like becoming attached to like a specific object they actually become obsessed None with like you? None of this happened before that. None of this we did. We came back and it started happening especially when we were alone just us but still things are happening even though the boys came back. So it's a little freaky but nothing happened before we went to the cemetery. Nothing did. Oh my god! And we were very respectful. And that's the only explanation. Yeah, we were very respectful. We don't try to goof around. We we didn't. We hardly talked. But I, this weird. is so crazy. Nothing has ha ever happened like this before. Never. 
This Actually, video one is... time for me, yes. <laughs> oh, well, okay, mom's the source of this. Well, Actually, one night. time for me too, but it wasn't like this much. Yeah, I'll tell that story in another story time. Me if too. To if you wanna hear some ghost story times, comment down below. But the light to our other room is currently out, so that room's darker now. What a great coincidence. I'm gonna sleep in that room. Actually, I'm gonna sleep on no. one of these beds. No, you're going to room. gone, so. No, you're going That's to where I am. <laughs> Me and Mom have this room. You guys get the haunted room. We're doing girls room, boys room. No, They're both haunted. Okay, you guys, there's more to this story. So we are sitting here just talking to each other. All the boys were in here except Dad was in the connecting room showering. And we hear a noise like bubblegum popping. It sounds and like Dad popped blue bubble and popped it in his we thought All Dad four of us heard it. We thought that dad was chewing bubble gum, but then Jake went in the other room because and he was- said, oh, he's done showering, go ask dad, you know, because Jake didn't want to go into the shower by himself, so I said, go have dad sit by you. <laughs> and dad was still in the shower. He doesn't even have bubble gum in his mouth. So, I don't know how we can explain that. And that he was in the shower with the door closed, but we all heard it. A popping noise. Like a bubble gum pop. And so- didn't you say the light went out in the hallway? It did. That's what you heard. You heard the pop of the light bulb go out. No, that, that was before. delayed. That was way delayed then. Oh. Yeah, we just heard it like recently. And so now everyone's know. scared. We're not leaving the room from each other. We're all huddled. And in Jake is room. Jake needs to shower from <laughs> swimming. And he <laughs> won't shower with the door closed and because Ty's he's scared. Ty is hiding underneath the table. <laughs> <laughs> Jordan, if you see this video, send help. <laughs> Your family is possessed. No, we're not possessed. The room is. We're, we're gonna be possessed by no, the end of this. We're, <laughs> we're gonna have to spend 24 hours in this haunted no, hotel room. I will, we don't have to. I'm, I'll leave. <laughs> yeah. Mom's giving up. Oh. And so the editing continues. <laughs> okay, you guys, the boys are back. Woo! And they brought us some yummy food. Yum. Yum. It is currently almost 11 o'clock p.m. That's how we roll. <laughs> we just eat really late. But nothing crazy has happened since they've been gone. Thank goodness. I hope that this stays that way and we don't get any more haunted things happening because that was like really freaky. All's normal here. It's all. All's normal here in the hotel room. But I am so excited to start eating this. We are hungry and then I'll check up on you guys before go we to go to bed. <laughs> okay, you guys, so it is bedtime. I took a shower, as you can tell. I'm in my piggy PJs all the way for bed and my video is rendering. It's approximately, every time I say approximately, I sound British, approximately 1 a.m. So that's fun. But everyone else is asleep, so I gotta be quiet. And yeah, I'm gonna get ready for bed. And I'll see you guys in the morning. Good night. Hi guys, it is morning time now. <laughs> and my mom and I were rudely awakened by the cleaning lady this morning. <laughs> I mean, she was coming in here to do her job, but she like kept knocking on the door and I'm like, what? And then finally we're like, oh no, it's the cleaning lady. And she woke us up at nine and we went to bed at like one, so. We wanted to sleep in. <laughs> but right now I'm working on my makeup. I have a little bit of it done and I'm gonna do like a little speed racy thing for you guys. But I do it in front of the mirror on the floor. It's a very comfortable position. While I'm doing that, I just like to watch some videos or listen to music, but this is where I'm sitting right now. And then after that, we gotta pack up so we can leave this place, this haunted hotel room. I don't wanna stay here any longer, and I hope that our next place isn't haunted. You guys will know if you follow me on Twitter. <laughs> At Oliver and Audrey. Okay, finishing up. This is so hard to balance a camera and do all this. Oh my goodness. Okay. Let's stick. Check. Oh, I think I just heard that. <laughs> and then my favorite part, the spray. <laughs> Yay. Okay. Makeup complete. 
let's get dressed and then finish up our morning routine. All right, you guys, makeup is done. Outfit check, I'm wearing my Queen of Pigs Feet shirt. And yep, we are ready to go. I just finished packing up, but we still have a lot of packing up to do as a family. And the clean ladies came back and checked upon us. But our check time isn't until like noon, so they're just really eager to clean our room. <laughs> I know, they're like, get out! But we're just getting some videos up for the day on our laptops. That's where we spend the majority of our time when we're in hotel rooms is like <laughs> the behind the scenes of our videos. <laughs> and so, yeah, we're just chilling out here and then we're gonna go get some breakfast. We may not make it for breakfast because it's already like 10, so we might just have lunch instead. <laughs> we've been have we've been on a super weird schedule. We only eat like twice a day because we like wake up kind of late-ish. I mean like nine isn't too too late, 9, like 10, one. but we stay up till like 12 and 1 every night, so we always have like a brunch and then dinners at like 11. <laughs> so yeah, and then we just snack throughout the day, that's so much our schedule. Okay you guys, we checked out of our hotel room, now we're gonna get some brunch at Denny's, <laughs> woo! So 24 hours is officially up. I am out of the hotel room. That was scary and I was not expecting it to be haunted, no. but nothing ever happened after dinner last night. So that was so weird and random. It looked really good. Nothing happened. Really good. We got our meals, super yummy. Okay, the boys ordered mac and cheese <laughs> with goldfish. No, stop it, it's my food. Anyways, if you guys enjoyed this video, give a big thumbs up. That was so fun, but also scary. Everyone's trying to steal my food. Go away. <laughs> and also remember to subscribe, turn from red to gray, and hit the bell icon to be notified whenever I post a new video. I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye.